Hello, you are welcome to this channel. In today's episode, I'm going to be uh, sharing with you 10 things that you should never say to a woman or else it is going to lead to resentment and conflict in that marriage or in that relationship. So, you are going to gain meaningful things from this video. I want you to join me and uh, pay close attention and watch this video to the very end. Number one thing that you shouldn't tell a woman is criticizing her appearance or weight. Yes, you shouldn't do that because it is going to lead to a uh, conflict or even low self-esteem for that woman. Before you marry a woman, you know her weight, you know her body size, you know everything. I believe that so many people, uh, they, they, they have what they want. They know what they want in a woman. So you criticizing a woman's weight or her uh, appearance is a no because she is going to be like, but you know how I am. You know how I was and all of these things. So it can lead to low self-esteem and it can lead to resentment in your marriage this little thing can lead to conflict in your marriage it is not even a little thing because criticizing a person's appearance or or, or weight is not is, is not a nice thing to do because before you go into that marriage you know how she was you know her appearance you know how she looked you know everything about her don't criticize a woman's appearance or a weight. Number two thing is disrespecting her opinion and belief. Yes, when you disrespect a woman's opinion or belief, she's going to feel unheard and she is going to feel undervalued. See, everybody's opinion or everybody's belief is valid. So, uh, you shouldn't disrespect a woman's point. A woman's opinion our opinion is also valid don't disrespect it understand her yes understand her don't respect disrespect her opinion or or believe if her opinion is different from yours make sure that you let her know that her opinion is valid and make us the reasons why you are not going with our opinion Yes, so don't disrespect a woman's opinion or belief. Make her understand that opinions and belief matters so that she's not going to feel unheard or undervalued, thereby causing resentment in that relationship or in that marriage or causing conflict. So don't disrespect her opinion. Next one is comparing her to other women. See, no woman is going to accept that from you. Comparing her with another woman. In fact, she's going to tell you that you are already cheating on her. You are, she's going to tell you that you are already looking outside. This is not healthy for a marriage. This is not healthy for a relationship. Con uh, um, comparing your woman your wife, the other woman, it is only going to build jealousy and insecurity. And you know what being insecure can lead to? It can lead to so many things. So, to prevent resentment in your marriage or relationship, to prevent conflicts in your uh, marriage or relationship, don't you ever uh, compare your woman with another person, another woman. Don't you ever do that mistake. Next one is belittling her or putting her down. Belittling her or putting her down is going to make her feel undervalued. Don't belittle a woman. There is much more than you think that she can do. You are belittling her like, what do you even know? What can you even do? And all of those things. Yes, men can do so so many things like that they can say so many things like that don't belittle to a woman and me or pull her down because she's going to feel inadequate and develop low self-esteem and trust me there's going to be issue in that your relationship or even that uh, marriage it can even break so don't belittle to a woman keeping secret or betrayer don't keep secrets because when she later finds out 
then she's never going to trust you again. You know, when there is trust in a marriage or when there is lack when there is lack of trust in marriage or lack of trust in a relationship, it is not going to go on well. It will never go well. Because there will be resentment, there will be conflict, there will be issues and all of these things. Keeping secret or lying to a woman means betrayal. And there will be resentment in that marriage or relationship. And that relationship or marriage is never going to be the same again. Next one is dismissing her emotion. When you dismiss a woman's emotion, she's going to feel unheard or unimportant. Don't dismiss her emotion. Everybody's emotion is valid. Yes, don't dismiss her emotion that she's no one. She's not valid, uh, our emotion is not valid or something. Don't do that. It is going to bring conflict, resentment, all of these things into that relationship that is that's supposed to go on well. So don't dismiss a woman's emotion. And the next one is refusing to compromise for every relationship, for every marriage to work. There should be room for compromising. Yes. You have to do some things that, you know, that is not really, really um, okay for you. That is not really easy for you to do. But you have to just do it just to make that marriage work. Just to make that relationship to work. So when there is no compromise, then she's going to feel unimportant. She's going to feel undervalued. She's going to feel unheard. And there will be resentment. I mean, so much resentment when you refuse to compromise. Maybe you want to go out with your friend and she's telling you that let us go out and enjoy ourselves. And you said, no, you want to go out and enjoy with your friend. Hmm. See, she's going to feel undervalued, feel she's not important. And there will be resentment. She's going to hold grudges. Issues will start to occur. And that is that. The next one is breaking up past mistakes and issues is something that you should never ever do. Bringing up past mistakes, things that are already forgiven or already forgiven or forgotten, or maybe so you have a little misunderstanding and you are not bringing it back. You are now bringing it back. Then you are creating issue again. You are bringing up issue again. It is not so healthy for your marriage or for your relationship. Don't you ever bring uh, past issues. Let the past be in the past and continue with the present. Looking forward to the future. The next one is making insensitive jokes. Yes. For example, making jokes about our weight or appearance in front of our friends or in front of your friends or in front of, you know, neighbors and every other things. Insensitive jokes. You shouldn't make it. You shouldn't make it because <laughs> there will be resentment in that marriage. There will be conflict in that marriage. And if care is not even taken, it can lead you to divorce or breakup or more things like that. It is not so early. Make sure that you are sensitive know what you have to say part time know the kind of jokes that you are going to make there are some men that they don't know the kind of joke that they they ought to make they just make joke anyhow and they believe that everybody will be fine with it they make joke with people's body they make joke with people's finances they make joke with people's appearance and they think that it is okay it is not okay do not make insensitive jokes with a woman because it is going to bring issues. And the last but not the least is dismissing our accomplishments. Yes, our accomplishment doesn't mean anything to you. You don't even congratulate her. You don't even make her feel special. You don't even make her feel valued for what she accomplished at work, in her career, and all of those things. She's going to feel unimportant, undervalued, and unsupported. So, do not dismiss your woman's uh, accomplishments. Don't dismiss it at all. Or else you are going to 
uh, have conflicts in that relationship or in that marriage and there is going to be a great resentment and which is not going to be a good thing so i hope that you enjoy this video i hope that you have learned something tangible and if so please make sure that you like this video make sure that you share make sure that you comment and make sure that you subscribe for more thank you very much and see you next time